See guys, I am changing my identity one step at a time because I literally like wore camo and I literally was saying like, oh, I just like wish I was like the type of person to put to that was put together because I had a camo shirt on. I wanted to finish making this video or like make this video anyways. Um, and then I put the black one on because I was like, no, like I'm changing the identity. I'm doing it right now. The time is now. Like, so I put on a black shirt. I like to wear black. Guys, I'm going to wear my camo shirt when I go out. Like, when I leave the house. Because it's, like, it doesn't match the background right now. Why would I? It just, I like that when things match. Because I just feel, like, it's, like, when, um, you look better, you're going to feel better. Because, obviously, that's the case. And also, just, like, that's why I sing the theme song, too, when I'm at work. And, like, to sing. Because singing is good for you. And I sing in the car sometimes. And yeah, singing is super good for you. Like, do things that are good for you because don't do them. Don't sing because you're happy. Sing because it will make you happy. Not that I even follow that all the time. But, you know, if I remember it and I'm like, oh, the time is now. I'm doing it now because that is who, yeah, I strive to be. But, yeah, so basically what I wanted to make this video about was I had more to add on to my last one because... Yeah, no, I just think I was born to be, like, in management because, like, my, like, having, like, literally as long as it gets managed, it doesn't know how. And it's, like, people thought that I had a maid. I don't know that many people. I literally, like, they come once a week and they clean. And, um, I still do all my laundry. I do laundry a lot, bro. I just, like, do what I need to do, and then I scroll on my phone, because I literally, like, I have a ritual, guys, because I literally get home from work, and I have my bubbly water, and I have my food, and yes, I just got back from work, and I changed also, so that's what's going on right now, and I made a video in the car, and I'm honestly probably gonna make three separate videos, so I made the one, and then there's gonna be the two, and then this is gonna be the third one, because I don't know, I just haven't posted in a while anyways, and I wanted to make videos, and I don't know, the first video I'm gonna have to edit, so I am gonna have to do that now, and it's like, <sighs> but this one I hopefully, I don't have to edit, um, but I did just want to, like, talk about life because I miss you guys. I miss YouTubing. I've been busy. I've been working. A girl has been working. She has been busy. She's not been doing much. That's been super exciting, but I feel like now it's, like, I don't know. I have, like, more to talk about now because, yeah. But, yeah, so basically my ritual is I had Twizzlers when I got home. Dude, they're really sweet Twizzlers, though. Like, that's a lot of, I don't like sugar because it's, like, if I'm gonna break out. I don't want to break out, but, um, what's it called? And then I had Oreos, and that's what I've had so far. <sighs> and, um, yeah, I think I have really clear skin. I really like my skin. Um, but, yeah, no, that's literally my ritual. I get home, I eat, and then I literally, like, lay in bed. Like, sometimes I'm literally wearing my work clothes. I literally, like, I go into a coma. Sometimes it lasts only, like, 30 minutes, and then I'm like, yes! But literally, I get to get back from work and it's coma. Like, today is different because I'm making a video. But it's like, my room still, it has four baskets on the ground of clothes. It has, like, 20 pieces of clothing. Like, two, three towels. Like, two other bins of clothes. I zip up this other thing I need to pick up, too. And, like, good old bars and, like, trash and stuff. And, like, I don't know. But... Yes, that's the situation here, and I think I am just gonna rest after I make this video, but that's a goal for today, because I want to pick that up, but yes, I think I was born to be a manager, because like, as long as, like, you just, you're hired, I keep trying to hire my sister for things, I'm like, you're hired, because she's like, does that look like my job, and I'm like, can it be like you're hired go like do it now um but yes so if any of y'all like these videos like you're hired you're hired because yes i like to I, i'm picky again i'm picky it's perfect i'm picky because i will do some things and then other, like, then other people who are good at the other thing and like those other things can do the other things it's a very good
I should watch the presidential debate too. Because I've been meaning to watch the presidential debate and I have not. I'm literally in disbelief right now. I'm in disbelief. Wait, mom, can I tell you? Or can I tell what they what you said? That everyone was wearing a mask? Like, am I allowed to say that? Or is that... Okay. Dude, everyone was wearing a mask at her job today. Because, like, the they obviously... They chose to, dad. No, no, no. My mom will never... She never says the words, I don't know. It drives me insane. Literally, she does not know how to admit it when she does not know something. She does not know how to say, I don't know. It's not in her vocab. I am always on her case about this. Because she'll be like... She just won't respond. She'll literally go down verbal. If she doesn't know the answer, she'll literally not respond. Like, and my dad just, like, yelled at her for saying, I don't know. Dad, I've been trying to get the words I don't know to come out of mom for years. When did I do that? Well, what? You said it's astonishing to hear that out of a medical professional. Well, that's one because she should, should actually know something. What we've been through in the last three years, and she still doesn't know why anyone wears a mask. Well, no, but. Do you think that's a, a, a knowledgeable question to be asking? Well, no. Yeah, well, I guess. Were they sick? Don't they have to fill out the flyer anyway if they're sick? Isn't that literally a question they ask? Have you been sick in the past? Or is that something else? Somewhere else? But every situation is different. So I was generalizing. But okay. Well. Mom. Had a of breast cancer, so mom. Okay. Anyways, I'm so proud of you, Mom. She said the words I don't know. I'm proud of you. Yes. I also just wanted to add that my mom does not go nonverbal when, like, you ask her questions, she doesn't know the answer, but she'll answer, like, every other question that could possibly be related to the question, or, like, she'll give you so much information and stuff instead of just saying, I don't know, she'll, like, try to know the answer, or, like, yeah, she literally, like, will literally beat around the bush, like, which I think is the perfect saying for that, like, literally, like, give you so much information that, like, could maybe answer your question, but really doesn't answer your question, because, like, she can't say. That's why. That's why she's like that. Also, that made me realize so much. That's why she's like that. That makes so much sense. I also just want to say I did watch the presidential debate, and it was not what I thought it would be. Like I feel like I got this feeling too when I used to um, go to class about the books that were assigned in college before I actually read the book or like the section of the book, anyways, that we were supposed to read. And then I realized, like, when I was reading the book, I'd, like, gotten such a different impression of it than, like, it actually was. And it was so different than I thought it would be. And that's why I was like, the presidential debate. Right? I also just wanted to say is, like, I don't know if this is this video or the video that I made right before this where I said, like, oh, my parents have ruined me. Like, with um, cleaning and stuff like that. But, like, I feel like another way that they've ruined me in a good way is, like, they took me to, like, a church as a kid that was really, like, for, like, old people. And I might even be dying right now. I kind of like it because it's like Episcopal which is kind of different but it's like I kind of like that it's like the everyday thing it's like oh yeah pray every day it's like I try to do like even more pre like I just think it's an everyday thing other like other denominations don't have like the everyday aspect in the like actually like written and like the whatever the differentiation things are documents fake documents like that but um yeah, no, so, like, that's ruined me in, like, a good way because now I go to these churches with, like, a younger, like, base group and, like, pastors, even probably younger pastors, even, and, like, that's why, like, so I don't know if, like, the one video with the conversation with me and my friends, it's, like, the one friend who said that she was, like, so sad that she missed it, I was, like, I wonder if that's real, like, I wonder if she actually was sad that she missed that, or if she's, like, obviously, like, when I bet she was, but anyway, like, it could sound, like, oh, like, it could be like a drag to some people but that's why i feel like it's not a drag for me because i feel like i'm used to so much more boring services that it's like and now it's like i listen and i feel like i do get out of it and also like yeah i just think about how it like relates to me and like how it's like and yeah i just like really enjoy going and stuff like that and i feel like yeah i also just wanted to say that it is literally the next day right now and i am like i'm in the same outfit pretty much but um 
yeah no so i do i haven't cleaned my room yet but i was gonna do that right after this and i i'm not even like bad on myself because what's it called um i'm literally what's it called it's fine that it's not like it's not completely messy and it's like completely fine and i'm gonna do that after this and it rained today so don't have to mow the lawn today so i can do that some other time this week which i'm pretty sure i can get done and then you know so just like redefining it's like fine first of all and then this is something i wanted to get done too i'm gonna go ahead and post some things so i'm glad that i'm able to do that for you guys because i miss posting stuff and having stuff to post about and yeah let me know if you guys want me to like yeah do like the home improvement one because i don't know what i would improve really but i also kind of know that i would do like certain things and like just yeah like 10 things you can do to upgrade your home like type of vibes and yeah but yeah um if you guys enjoyed watching this video do not forget to leave a like don't forget to comment down below what you'd like to see more of and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and yeah thank you guys for watching oh my gosh i also wanted to add that i will not put a budget around this video because um uh i once said at a job interview i was like oh yeah sometimes you don't always need as much money as you think you do it was a sales job interview keep in mind that is not what they were looking to hear I don't think that that was at all what they were maybe maybe I just didn't get the job for other reasons I also like didn't really want the job at the time because I really didn't know like it was like a different type of job that I'd never done before it was like I don't know I'm not gonna explain it but um yeah no it was a sales job though so I'd be making sales and I had never like done and like obviously you make sales but it wasn't like paid hourly it was paid based on sales and I like didn't know how like my confidence was on that so it's like I did want the job but I didn't but I also said sometimes you don't need as much money as you think you did I literally was like dude that's not something you say edit anyways so I'm not gonna make a much budget because I feel like you guys all have different uh, yeah but yeah so yeah also, I think I'm going to make this part of my intro now because I really haven't been. If you guys want to follow me on Instagram and follow me on and or follow me on TikTok, my um my what's it called? Tags. What's a username? My I don't know, there was like a word someone used and I'm like trying to remember. Anyways, but the usernames are going to be in the description of this video. And yeah, if you guys want more content by me, yeah, make sure to check those out. So yeah, thanks again for watching.